All right, it is 6 April 2022. Sea of red today. A sea of red, surprisingly. It looked like stuff was moving up. We we're on an upswing. Now we're back down. 43.2 Bitcoin, 3,100 ETH. Very surprising to me. Oh, well, that just shows you just don't know what this market is going to do. That's why you just keep dollar cost averaging in and you keep on mining, right? Keep those rigs running. Just keep them running as long as you got power, right? All right. Hey, today, SRB Miner, they have a new release a couple days ago came out and I just lost it. Where did it go? <laughs> oh my, it is, here it is. In the github.com, you can see the URL right there, right up here, watch. And of course, as I shake it, it gets bigger, and as we know, that's what she said. All right, I have to say that every time now. Um, anyway, SRB Miner Multi CPU and AMD GPU Miner 094, Win64, and Linux released two days ago. Uh, 094, I was running 093, so found out this was out. I downloaded it on five of my CPU miners. And I am up and running right now. So here we go. We got the uh, added algorithm SHA3D for all these coins right there. That I can't even say them. I'm not going to try for CPU, GPU mining. Fee 0.85%. And then we got added algorithm 0x10 uh, chain ox. I've heard of that, but I never mind it. For CPU, GPU mining, same fee. Performance increase on curve hash which is Pulsar coin. So Curve Hash improved performance on the Curve Hash algorithm for Pulsar coin up approximately 25%. So if you're actually CPU mining uh, Pulsar coin, you definitely want to go download the latest SRB miner. Uh, I typically use SXM rig for Don Raptorium and other coins, but for this coin, I had to use SRB miner. I just picked that one. XM rig didn't really run with this Pulsar coin. Okay, they removed the ASTR OBWT algorithm. I don't know what that is. And they removed this parameter or CN mode. Uh, they fixed issue. It must have been a bug. We can click on it. Let's do it. Let's be brave. I am brave. Are you brave? But anyway, before I click on it, uh, they got the Linux tar, they got the Windows, and they got the source code. I just downloaded the Windows zip, and I am good to go. I want to see what issue they fixed. Whoa, they did, okay, I got to sign in. Forget it. All right. Um, what did I do? Zerg pool. I am mining Zerg pool, Pulsar coin on Zerg pool. And you can see I did update my CPUs. And I like I like this pool. I don't know why. I just like it. It's up and down. Who cares? It works. It has good information. It's not full of uh, fluff. It gives me all the deets. I know the details. And uh, I went back. I am shared mining. I found it is actually more consistent and I get more Pulsar coin by doing shared mining instead of just solo mining, hoping and hoping that I'm going to hit a block. And uh, you can see right here, look at that. These are all shared mining. This one, I stopped it. I was trying something else. I, I went to pool mining overnight and I hit nothing. So that's why this is that. And then I went back to shared mining today and there you go. Almost a hundred, you could say. Uh, here we go over here, my rigs, and they are running 094, 094. This is a ghost jet, it still hasn't aged out because I just upgraded Rocco Taco Rig 10 to the 094. We are up and running Pulsar in shared mode. All looking good, man. We are looking good, and I'm just stacking coins. I am just stacking it. So let's go over and look at this guy. Oh, let's see. Hash rate is right here. If I click... Oh, it's dry. I don't know what it did there. It kind of dropped. It went up a little bit. It's dropped. So it dropped a little bit. It went up and dropped. Prices all over the place. Uh, up and down, up and down. Again, I don't, I'm learning as I mine and I invest in crypto not to give a crap about the uh, equivalent fiat value in US dollars. I don't care. I'm just trying to get coins right now and uh, hold them. That's what I'm doing. Uh, so here we are. I am on what pole? Zerg pole. You go over here and click on it. And then you can see, oh, they had, they were heading out. I heard someone say on a Discord, I think it was on Pulsar Coin Discord, they had an outage or they were down. That's fine. Crap happens to most pools. Uh, so that's to be expected. But anyway, back up and running, no problem. 
and we are good to go. That's why my monitor. All right. So having said that, uh, you gotta. Yeah, it's almost a maintenance thing. You gotta come in here and check and say, "Oh my God, I had a dip here. What happened?" And with my CPU miners, I don't really get reported that things are down. So you gotta go check the pool. And I did notice I had two rigs running. The rest dropped off because of the outage on Zerg pool. I don't know why the other two survived, but uh, four. Uh, how many do I have running? Five. So three. Three of the five did not come back after the uh, mining pool drop, but I had to go manually restart it. Then, uh, like it, anything in mining, becomes a rabbit hole, and you find, oh my god, now there's a new SRB miner. So, restart, stop, download, uh, configure it, copy the files over, set the properties to make it run as admin, and then fire back up, and then check here. And it's a whole process. It takes about a half hour. Uh, could be easier. Again, I do it all through Windows because I'm just a control freak. I want to control what's running, where it's running. I want to know exactly what the commands are and no middleman and no fees. You know what I mean? I know people love Hive OS and all that stuff. Maybe one day I'll use it, but right now I just have a process and it works. It's no big deal. Um, yeah, Windows until I can't do it anymore, until I get more hardware. And I'm getting going to build two more rigs next week, so... That may be the breaking point to just use Hive OS, but I don't know yet. I don't know. Because when I do switch coins, it does take a little bit. All right, so that's it. We are up and running. We got an ad here. Let's see what the ad is. Pillar or something. Build your wealth. I just got some basic attention token by clicking on that. If you do not, if you don't have Brave Browser on your on your, on your uh, desktop, get it. I mean, it blocks ads and you get paid to click on ads and you build up attention token. Basic attention token. I mean, it's a win. It is a win, especially on YouTube. All ads are blocked except embedded ads in the videos. So think about that. I mean, I can't watch commercials anymore. I, I go to my other computer, my TV, and I run YouTube on my TV. I freak out. What's that? It's a commercial. I just hate commercials because they're almost a brain. A prop. They're almost a brain. They're almost a form of propaganda. Just a. I don't know. It's just crap. All right, that is it. Let's go say goodbye to Zergi Pool. Everything looks good. This one will go away because it's 093. It'll age out. And uh, things are running. I just want to keep mining Pulsar coin and just get a bag full and then move on from there to uh, maybe another coin. Uh, right at this point, I will have one, two, three, four, five. I'll have seven rigs and I'm getting a 3950X and another 3900 in. And that's going to be some more yummy power. I know maybe I'm not making money or not. I don't care. I just want to get mining. Because I know it's up and down, up and down. I'm in for the long haul, and I'm basically mining to hold coin. Uh, that's my goal right now. All right, thanks for watching. That is all. I got a little update, SRB Miner, uh, mainly for Pulsar Coin. If you're out there, you get a 25% boost increase. Uh, go check it out. Check your links. Check the downloads. Make sure you're on the right site. You're not getting the wrong software downloaded. All right, thanks for watching, guys. Go out. Do great things.